Over 6,000 tickets were out within five minutes when four performances by the Berlin Philharmonic Orchestra in Shanghai opened for sale worldwide in early April. I should say this project has attracted a lot of foreign visitors who bring their tickets to Shanghai to see the orchestra. According to the figures, there are now more than 40% foreign visitors and more than 10% of the outside visitors who come to Shanghai to see the orchestra and Berlin Philharmonic Orchestra. I came from Guangzhou. 过来买了三茶，中间还得回去，还要回去上班的。我是北京过来的，就之前因为就是大家可能也是只是网友，然后现在就变成见面了。我今天明天啊，但是因为二十九、三十的票没抢到啊。因为之前柏林爱乐团也来过，然后一直没有机会，就是没抢到票，然后这次就太太开心了。嗯<笑> Since 1979, the Berlin Philharmonic Orchestra has visited China five times, including three tours at the China Shanghai International Arts Festival. The last time they performed in Shanghai was in 2017. In a first concert during this tour, the Berlin Philharmonic Orchestra presented the same program from their season finale at the Weltbühne, held just four days earlier to the audience in Shanghai. I mean,、uh, when you are coming to Shanghai after seven years, you have to decide what to play, and I think it's very important that we show a wide range of repertoire. So we are playing core repertoire like Strauss Heldenleben. But also niche repertoire, which we just played in a big, big, big open air concert in the Waldbühne. So you will see from French music to German music to Beethoven,、uh, Prokofiev. You have you have everything. Shanghai is the orchestra's only stop in China, featuring nearly 120 top musicians. It includes four symphony concerts. Seven chamber music performances and a series of engaging activities in arts education, including open rehearsals, master classes, and lectures. The orchestra also visited university campuses, local communities, and cultural landmarks across Shanghai. 在近十天的演出活动过程当中，可能会有三万名市民啊，那么会近距离的跟柏林爱乐乐团啊来见面。从这个项目的规模，包括到上海驻演的时长，以及覆盖的人群，应该说都创下了一个记录。You can see that in in all China, of course, there's a huge interest for classical music. I've been traveling to Shanghai more than 20 years, and I've seen all the concert halls being built. That's of course why we're also interested to come here and have an exchange, also with the artists who are who are of course on stage here in your fantastic venues. And it's important that we engage with. The community and music lovers all around the city, and so that means students. That means people in different settings than in the concert hall. That's really meaningful to to build the relationship and also to have some sort of impact on the next generation of, of musicians and music lovers.